So what, what, what's in this box? It's circuit board, basically, it, what it's been basically built for. If you're in a house and you want to find where you are electrical wiring, you have, you have machines that basically can find your wires. Yeah. That's basically all it is. Well, like a stud wall. Yeah. Of, yeah, right. Um, okay. What this has been designed for ghost hunting is, it's basically been a handheld side, but it picks up on that because it's been proven, not proven as in we can prove it, because in the day we can't prove Unless we, people are physically there when they see it and it's been documented and you, you try and debunk everything possible, you're yeah. never going to prove it. But we believe, and the, the, the theory goes, that spirits interact with magnetic energy. Right, and that's picking up magnetic energy. Ma ma yeah. Or magnetic fields, shall yeah. we say. Yeah. So what's it, mini, mini gauss? Mini gauss. So what's, that, what's that unit of then? Lect um, electric I've, yeah. heard of, I've heard of gauss before. That's, yeah, gauss. That is, yeah. yeah it's, it's basically, it's a, it's a field of the distortion in the electromagnetic field. So how sensitive is it? Because obviously these both are off at the same time. Okay, if you get your mobile phone on a smartphone, turn it on. And they'll go crazy. Yeah, they'll go mental. Because it's, it's something that's interfering with that. But the camcorder doesn't. The camcorder doesn't because batteries don't kick it's off. It's still electronic fields in there, though, isn't it? <laughs> It doesn't kick out stuff. It doesn't like send signals out like a mobile phone does. Right. Okay. So sending the that's, a, well, that's a radio wave it's sending yeah. out, isn't it? Basically, if you had a wireless network in your house, yeah, it would be picking up. So picking up Wi-Fi. Wi is bouncing around. What's this little button here doing? That's just oh, turning right. on and off. Oh, okay. So I just turned it off. All right. <laughs> so I didn't want to press it too hard. I thought it might break. No, no. The, the original one, you had to put a jam of 10p down the bottom to keep it on. You had to hold it. Oh, really? It it's pretty high tech then. Yeah. So what this device is, this is called Novelist. This, this is literally been out in the market for about six months. 500 quid. Oh, wow. well, that's my first yeah. second question. And basically <laughs> what it does is, it's got multiple functions on here, but we, we ask Spirit to, to come forward, to interact with it, and it's programmed with 10,000 words. Each time an energy comes through, it can interfere and it will try and, pick, and whatever, whatever it inter however it interferes with the device will pick up a word and it will try and communicate. Sometimes they might make, make no sense whatsoever. One thing it has been proven, it's not a random word generator. It's been proven that, it's been tested. I've had this device, the old one, on for an hour, it didn't say a word. I've walked into another room and it's, you can't stop it. So I'm going to turn it on. You'll hear a voice which sounds a bit like Stephen Hawking. It says dictionary mode. So with, with the old one, you just had to listen. With this one, you'll actually see the word appear. So if you are not 100% sure what the word, what he said, it would appear. So the two lights will flick and it's just scanning. It's sending the energies out, sending the waves out. Spirit, does anybody here, can you please step forward? I'm holding a device with two yellow lights on. Can you talk through, please? Can you come and talk to us? My name's Carl. Can you tell me your name? Enter. Enter. Where would you like us to enter? It's not enter, is it? Sure, you've got a pressure into the game. No, 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 that's a word. Entire. Entire. Oh, right. Entire what? Could you elaborate, please? It doesn't make sense to us. You're asking your name. Yeah, yeah, look. I'm going crazy on. Oh, no. So we missed you, it. Yeah, no. Please give us a little bit more information about who you are. Uh, Carl's been here several times. This is the first time a visit that Nick, Chris, and Stuart have been here. Uh, we wish to, to, to meet you and greet you, and if you possibly wouldn't mind giving us some information about yourself, we'd be very, very grateful indeed. We have a box here that Carl, the gentleman wearing the hat here, and the lights you can see in his hand, if you can use the energy from that machine and manipulate it to, to speak, we can have a conversation. So please, can you tell me your name? As you can, there's the batteries, you put that on there, it doesn't go off. Look, it's all going now. Uh, so you Chris, bring yours over here, see if yours goes. Look, yeah, you're see, look. Oh so it's right on this yeah. area, isn't it? You can see all those lights there, it's great to see all your energy, but now there's a machine there we can use 
to speak. So would you like to say your name or say any kind of message whatsoever to us? The weird thing is, this isn't going off now, but it does over here. Bring yours over here again, Chris. So it's almost as if it's this area here, isn't it? I think it just follows you. It's just following us. I think when we're over there, we're over there. I can guarantee if we stood over there, it would probably go off as well. No, I'll say, if you concentrated there, but not, yeah. when these are going off, your one wasn't, it wasn't like they were all going off. Come on, not going oh, he's spoken. A placebo. A placebo. Are you trying to say something's not real? Are you trying to say you're not real in some way? Placebo is an unusual word to use. Well, Can you say if you're English? Or are you trying to say something in French or Latin? Placebo, that's when you think something's happening, but it's all in the mind, isn't it? It's when you hear a suggestion, isn't it? You give someone a placebo medicine, it's... Yeah, placebo, isn't it? Yeah. It's basically if you can give a sugar tablet. Yeah, yeah, exactly. A placebo effect. So what is he trying to say there, then? Can you say, use, use the machine again. You said two words that don't seem to be related. You would now like a word that we'd understand. Maybe your name or possibly your rank or when you were here. Something along those lines would be very useful. Are the two soldiers here? French soldier and the English soldier here. Can you come and talk to us? I don't know, my, my head torch just dimmed and didn't come back on again. Or like flickered. Well, yeah, I was thinking, is it? I didn't want to say that, Chris. <laughs> Spirit, come forward. Come and talk to us. We've got people in the room who just want proof that you're there. Set, set my machine off. It was over here it was going off. Just here. Yeah, so Follows you around. He might have gone now. He might have gone down his tunnel. Light up these grey devices we're holding. If there are any soldiers in this room, I'm more than happy for you to touch me or push me. I'm not worried about any physical interaction. If that's the best way for you to make your presence known, please feel free to come and touch me anywhere you like. Poke me, prod me. I'm more than happy for an interaction with you. Thank you. 